Hi everyone. Right, here's one of the new trims that's come in and it's the leaf one and I absolutely love it. It is a goupier leaf, it is very sturdy and you can actually cut them up and use them individually. So I'm just showing you what they're like. I mean, that's the size. They're absolutely gorgeous. Um, <clears throat> I only bought so much, so much in just to see it because I thought if it was going to be that flimsy cheap crap, I'm not buying it. But it's actually quite a good one. So I'm going to get some more of this in. Uh, this will go up on the store right now. I also want to share some of these that I've been making. Um, these I sell in, well, the, not this particular one. I've actually made this one, but I do sell these in the store. Uh, they're the new ones. I've put the bead cap on the top of mine, but these are the handmade ones. Oops, sorry. Handmade pins, and it's just made with wire, uh, roundel. Sorry, it's not very clear. Um, the bead, and then I put a little bead cap on top of that. I've also made these using the new crown, you know, the small crown. Um, and what I've used is um, a filigree bead, the gorgeous, um, it's double-ended bead cap roundel, pearl bead, the crown, bronze crown, and then a little rose with a diamante in the top. Um, and they're just to decorate flowers, just to do handmade flowers. But if you can afford to get the... Um, ready-made ones then make your own it's a little bit of wire garden wire and thread everything on glue it all down and pop something over the top so that the wire doesn't go through um, and there you go you can make your own stick pins they are gorgeous and uh, you can put anything on I mean if you look I've got dozens and dozens of videos on stick pins of all kinds you know lots of people have gone on from finding mine to making some um, uh, I do the butterfly one where you add lace on and everything. Um, and I'm not the only one. I'm not saying I'm the only one that's done uh, butterfly stick pins and things like that. But I hadn't seen any up to when I put it on. And uh, and now we see a lot of them. So in fact, some people make some fantastic ones. So these are just a little... Let me put the other one in. These are just a little collection of pins that I've been working on. Right, when I came back from the Netherlands, I brought some of this, um, they were my cards that I collected, my postcards. But it came in this little bag. And I love them. And you see this, what you do is you take your cabochon and I can put a windmill on there. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to show you how to do it. You take some glossy accents, you pop the glossy accents onto the little area. Then you take your cabochon, I only want the small one. I'm going to have a teardrop one, I think. Yeah. And you pop that over. Like that. I'm going to spin it around, actually. Like that. See? And then when that's dry, you just cut around it. And then you can use that on something else. Um, there's lots and lots of things. Like I've got a, a rosette thing here. Just put, you don't need much, just a scraping on. Take your cabochon, and look, I've already got that one. Just going to make sure that's straight-ish. So I've done that one. Uh, and you just continue to do that. Um, like here's a tiny little windmill. And I do have a small cabochon. So I'm going to pop that on there. Like that. So we've got a little bit of the land there. And I let them dry and then I just cut them out. Um, I'm not sure if I've got one big enough for the... I've got a face here. Well, I can do that, though. You never want to put... Oh, I can do it that way. Just the nose and the eyes. I'm going to do that. So take my um, bit of glue... Take my cabochon, holding the hand and trying to do it, right there. And I've got that. And I can use that in a project somewhere. See? 
So they're easy to do, and you can do it on a magazine. Just find, get a magazine, find things you want. Um, I do, like I say, I do sell them, and I sell them in different shapes as well. Um, I'm going to put them back on the store because I had them on the other one, but I've, uh, I'm going to put them onto this one, and uh, you'll be able to use them. So that's another way of using cabochons, make your own pictures. <laughs> 